Okay, I'm going to tell you about the time that uh, I went to Delamo Swap Meet. I went to like a store and this guy went up to me and he's like, hey, I'm a tattoo artist. I can do tattoos for you and charge you like a hundred bucks. And I was like, no, that's okay. Because at Delamo Swamp Meet, I think there's like two tattoo places. I'm not too sure, but I was like, no, thank you. Then um, I went to one of the tattoo places. They have like a booth or something. And I had a picture of the tattoo that I wanted. And I was waiting at the counter for like a good almost 10 minutes and then the lady that helped me was super rude she was like covered in tattoos head to toe and I showed her a picture and I said hey can I get this tattoo and she's like well if I do it I think she wanted to charge me like 850 for the tattoo and she said it would take like 45 hours and I had to keep coming back in sessions and I was like oh okay because she was just the whole time rude didn't want to bother like she was just annoyed by me and the problem with the tattoo booth is everyone getting their tattoos done you could see it so I was like you know what the swamp meat is not like I mean the swamp meat you could get tattoos there but I say be careful like my mom had a friend that got tattoos at the swamp meat he got like um sleeves for his arms and he got an infection then uh my mom's other friend he went to, like, a tattoo place, but, like, he also got an infection, so you have to be careful. And then this girl that I talked to at school, she said that she got her tattoo at a swamp meet, like, a few months ago. And it was, like, a color tattoo, but it was, like, already fading away. And she said she regrets it because they did such a bad job. So in my experience, like, I mean, it's your life, do what you want to do, but me personally, I don't think I would get tattoos at a swamp meet, because yeah, at the booth that was there, they said, oh, tattoos starting from $50 and up, which is not a bad price, but when it comes to tattoos, I'm more picky about who I go to, I do my research beforehand, and you have to be careful, because you always have the risk of getting an infection. So that's why aftercare is so important. Like when I get a tattoo, I make sure to put lotion on it constantly and follow all the aftercare rules because I do not want to get an infection. I've heard people that got infections and my mom's friends, when they got infections, they had to go to like the hospital and see a doctor. And so I'm just a little more cautious, you know.